If people begin again and again to live well the present moment, you realize with time, even if they have not made a specific intention to do so, that their actions have taken on a note of solemnity. You notice that their lives rest on a single supernatural support, love of God. But at the same time, this aura of solemnity profoundly affects every activity of theirs and enriches their lives greatly. As a consequence, their spiritual features come into focus with ever greater precision. You can say of them, for example, that they are immersed in God in prayer, free and happy in company with others, precise in doing their duty, demanding of themselves, like a brother or sister with everyone, uncompromising in disciplining those who depend upon them, merciful with the fallen, convinced like rock of their own nothingness and God's omnipotence, dissatisfied often with their own accomplishments, ready always to hope and begin again. This perpetual beginning again required by a human life traumatized by original sin helps the soul to clothe itself with consistency, even amidst a variety of activities. And this will touch it with the fragrance of sanctity, at first a little, then more and more. Saints are those who live no longer in themselves, within their own will, but transferred into another. <laughs>